Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to create your very own Facebook page. The first thing you'll need to do, if you haven't already done so, is sign up for a Facebook account. Now once you've done that, you'll need to log in to that Facebook account. Uh, once you're logged in, play, pay very special close attention to the URL right up here. You'll want to go to this exact URL, www.facebook.com slash pages slash create dot php and that will take you to the page that I'm on right now now once you're on this page you'll want to select which type of company you want to create a page for on Facebook if you're a small shop or local business you may want to choose local business or place if you're a larger company you may want to choose company or institution and of course brand or product artist public figure entertainment or cause or community which would be great for like a ministry or a nonprofit organization now today I'm gonna to set up a brand or product and my brand has to do with uh, sports I'm gonna see if they have that as a category since it's the first thing that I'm being asked for and if I can't find that then I'm gonna find the closest category uh, to it so I'm gonna say uh, outdoor gear and sporting goods and then I'm gonna say HR baseball is my brand or product I'm going to agree to the Facebook page terms and I'm gonna click getting started now if you would have selected one of these other options for the business type you would have been asked for different information. Now the next step is I'm going to uh, get a profile pic for my business. So I'm going to choose to upload one from my computer. You can also choose one from your website. And for just the sake of keeping things simple, I'm going to choose this icon. Oh, but it's telling me that's a little bit too small of an image. So let me see if I can find uh, a better image here. Okay, so I'm going to choose this baseball bat image and hopefully that'll be the right size. So you can see that's uploaded as my profile pic. Now I can resize that to be 100 by 100 or whatever the optimum size is for Facebook and it won't have that little bit of distortion that you see there. Then I'm going to click net the next button and that's going to take me to my next step. And then it's asked me please provide some basic information about HR baseball. And here I recommend that you give a brief keyword loaded description of your uh, product or brand or your business so that way when search engines do you know pick up uh, your Facebook page you'll show up for relevant search results so if people are searching for baseball gear for example then hopefully they'll find my website hrbaseball.com so let me just type a brief description Okay. and then I'm going to add my website URL and then I'm going to click Save Info. Now that'll take me to my last step which is choosing a Facebook URL and I'm going to choose a unique one just call it uh, HR Baseball. So what I'm doing is I'm choosing a short name to give to people uh, that will send them directly or short URL that will send them directly to my Facebook page. So I want facebook.com slash HR Baseball and I'm going to choose set address. Oh, this address is not available so I'm going to have to choose a different address. Let's try that one. Okay, so that one's good and now I have my very own Facebook page set up and the first thing it like wants me to do is like this Facebook page to show support for it. I'm going to skip that option. You'll want to like your own page though. And then the next thing is it's going to ask you to invite your friends. So when you click next, it will uh, you know show the option for you to invite uh, up to your first 50 likes via your friends and also via email. And then it's telling me here, you know, share something by posting it in my timeline and then of course it's walking me through where to get help so that's it once you go through all these steps you'll have your own Facebook page that you can access by that short URL and you'll want to take the next steps to get likes 
Um, don't forget to visit webstarts.com not only to see more helpful videos like this, but to build your very own free website. And if you read blog.webstarts.com, you can find lots of ways to get more likes on your Facebook page.